Hey guys, and welcome to my first Minecraft video. Today, I will be showing you the update from 1.2.5 to 1.3.1. Now, to get started, I'm just going to quickly go through these. You can pause and read them if you want, but, you know, I'm just going to go through them. Single player run server internally, publish single player instance to LAN, automatically detect LAN worlds in multiplayer screen, added cheats, I'll be showing you, added bonus chest, I'll be showing you, added adventure mode, can't right now, added trading with villagers, I'll be showing you, added the emerald stuff, I'll be showing you, cocoa beans to jungles, I'll be showing you, added the ender chest, I'll be showing you, added tripwires, I'll be showing you. Um, added new creative mode inventory, made it possible to gain enhancement orbs from mining ore and smelting, added writable books, and I'm going to be showing you uh, the books because they're cool. Added large biomes world type, I won't be showing. Added temples to jungles and deserts, I'll be showing the desert temple. Added chat settings, snooper data stuff. Um, um, I'm gonna skip, uh, okay, to the, the slash seed. So the slash seed command, I'll be showing you if you want the same seed as this. Skip, skip, skip. So, and then the enchantment level is now 30. So it was decreased from 50 to 30. Slash tel the teleport command can now send you to specific coordinates. Skip, skip. I'm going to show you something that I hate about this. Uh, skip, skip. S the stars stuff is pretty cool. Um, the sky color in the end has been changed. I have not seen that one yet. So, I mean, I might be able to make a portal. So, you know and just end it there. Um, the pick block functionality has been improved. Um, I'm going to skip to the gravel texture. The gravel texture has been modified. Levers can be placed on roofs. Um, I'll be skipping this, this, and then they removed Herobrine, which sucks. Or Herobrine, depending on how you pronounce it. Anyway, Let's get to it. Mojang. Now, okay, so this is my world. Um, on the create a new world, same. Everything is the same. Um, except the more world options. The cheats is like single player commands. Bonus chest is, um, uh, it's basically just a chest you get that starts you off. So, pretty much that. Uh, I guess I'll just show you that. And then there's default, super flat, large. So, I'll just create a new world really fast. And then once you create a new world, it flashes back to the main menu. Which is really weird. And then, it, the the new spawn is weird. It's, it's like you spawn kind of out of space, and then you fall into the normal world. So... I guess here okay there's the flash to the main menu and then we fall out of space kind of and then it lags a bit yeah it always lags in the beginning that's what I don't like about it but see here's the chest open that up and it starts you off with the little kit so yeah Okay, now, I'm going to be showing you this. Okay, the emerald. That's what the emerald ore looks like. That is what the emerald looks like. And that's the emerald block. So, there's that. And then, you'll it, if you have a pick, then you'll get XP for mining this. Um, yeah. Okay, trading with villagers. If I go over here, let's say this guy, and I right click, it'll say, I'll trade you 14 wool for an emerald. And I'm just like, I don't have 14 wool, so screw you. Um, let's 
let's see if we can find anyone. This village is like creepy. I mean, you have like all these dark places. And it's a sand village, which is kind of cool, but it's just plain creepy. There used to be like a ton of cows here. But now they're all okay. Uh there's someone in here. I'm James Bond. What? I just broke through your roof. And they're gone. Okay, here's a There's a person that just walked over here. That's the same guy. Come on. I need somebody. Okay, okay. Here we go. So, three emeralds for one flint and steel. Now, here's the inventory. Um, it's pretty much, you know. I want that flint and steel. So, you put the emeralds in there, take out the flint and steel, and then say, you know what? I don't like this. And then, right click and ha! Catching on fire. Okay, well, there's that. And then, you saw the new inventory. Now, the cocoa beans in the jungle. I don't know if you can see. What the? Is that a pig right there? Oh my gosh. Okay. This little pod is a cocoa bean. So when you break the wood that it's on, it'll drop cocoa beans. Woo! Yay for cocoa beans. Um, then the gravel texture changed. I'll go ahead and just show you really quick. That's gravel. So, yeah. And then the wood thing, there's this new wood that if you come up and place it, it'll face you like that. So you can have like a sideways tree. It's like, what's up with that? Okay. Something is going, is it, it must be turning, okay. It's daytime still. But this is like my little, you know, night, day sensor. I wonder, I wonder what this guy will trade. Oh, so he enchants. Okay, so I'm guessing that like whatever they're wearing has something to do with how they enchant. I guess. Um, the search function, it's like trip, there's the trip wire hook. And if you search, you have to push escape. Um, I'll be showing you the trip wire hook really fast. So, this is my little house right here. And this is the trip wire. This is string. So, two trip wire hooks and string. Yeah. And then here's the stars. They kind of look, they look a lot better, you know? But, and if I'm in creative mode, and I walk over to this creeper, watch what happens when I hit this creeper. Okay, that wasn't supposed to happen. Let's say I hit this spider. It'll come at me for just a bit. And then if I just walk like like let's let's try out the trap. If I walk over here to my trap. Okay. Let's see if I can find a zombie. The zombies will cooperate. Okay, the zombie. 